Stand by for action. Oh, I've been a vegan since the 80s. The 70s, we here. I'm dying. You know, some people reckon that uh, vegans don't have a sense of humour. Those people are wrong. Now, this is um, my little vlog for um, VegFest. I'm uh, talking about uh, my involvement in the Pro Intersectional Summit Conference gathering thingy. And um, first of all, I'd like to thank uh, Tim and Alan for organising it. Uh, it must be a lot of work, especially Alan, because I know he does all the work while Tim's watching football. So um, I've always said that I'll be approaching this conference um, as a student rather than a, a lecturer or a teacher uh, because I want to be there to to learn from uh, the people who've done a lot of intersectional work and the people of colour who are going to be there. Uh, very important to um, listen to them. In fact, uh, that's really what I, I want to say in the sense that um, intersectionality interested me from my academic work because I was already involved with you know things like critical criminology, radical sociology, and um, that looked at things like overlapping oppressions. And so that kind of brings us into the kind of area of uh, what we, or what I understand as intersectionality. And uh, I associate with things like alliance politics uh, from people like Steve Best. Um, again, the kind of interlinking. There's David Nybert and the entanglements of oppression and liberation, those kind of ideas. Uh, logic of domination from the eco-feminists and in fact those ideas go back to the 1950s as I understand it. Then a more kind of anarchistic idea um, which is um, we are each other and in fact um, speaking of that just to um, just to finish this off this is um, one side of a poster which we also a leaflet that we use for VIP Vegan Information Project and this uh, let's see the side but I'm just going to be using one side uh, for the moment let me get it up on the screen so I can see it myself and um, so this, this was uh, made uh, for VIP by a genderqueer, um, straight-edge vegan uh, feminist. Try saying that when you're pissed. And um, this really is, for me, the core of intersectionality. And the, the, three, the three issues that um, are on the front page of this, which are the things that I'll talk about now, is the issue of being consistent, be a respectful ally, and show solidarity. And in particular, be a respectful ally. That's what I'm intended to do in terms of this conference. And it says here, um, don't speak for people. Create a space where they can speak for themselves and be heard. Don't always know best. So that's one issue about intersectionality which appeals to me, actually. Because it says to us as animal advocates, you know, listen, be humble, and listen first speak later and that's certainly what I'll be doing at the conference so looking forward to it thanks again to Tim and Alan and I'll see you then if the old ticker if the old ticker lasts until October <laughs>